So last week someone said that uh, because I said Bowling Green was going to throw four touchdowns that I should quit my job and work at Wendy's. I'd love to work at Wendy's, purveyor of <laughs> fine cheeseburgers and cheeseburger accessories. Uh, unfortunately, I'm here giving you outrageous predictions for Ohio State versus Tulsa. Bill Landis and Ari Wasserman at Cleveland.com. Ari, I'll let you go first while I think about working at Wendy's. Honestly, he lives near a Dairy Queen and he can get blizzards. Talk about the frosty man. Okay. Um, I think Mike Weber is going to rush for three touchdowns this week. He didn't rush for any last week, and I think that he was the only player on the Ohio State roster to not score a touchdown. <laughs> Bill Landis told me that the weather forecast is predicting rain, and I do think that Ohio State's going to make a concerted effort to get things going on the ground a little bit, maybe feed the freshman a little bit. Three is a lot of touchdowns for anybody. That's not JT Barrett. Three touchdowns for Mike Weber is outrageous. He was mad he didn't score. Uh, my outrageous prediction, and maybe this is a little too crazy, is that Ohio State will score two defensive touchdowns. Uh, we saw them score one last week, and it was Rajay Burns. And if you could tell me where Rajay Burns is from and what year he is, I'll give you a million dollars. Louisville. Got him. Freshman Rajay Burns had turned a pick six last week. I, Tulsa has a, a quick passing game, a spread offense. They like to throw some quick screens and things like that. Uh, I think Marshawn Lattimore gets his hands on one and returns one. And I think Gary on Conley gets his hands on one and returns one. So, so not only is he being outrageous, giving you, he's giving you the... Marshawn Lattimore pick six, Gary on Conley pick six. I will be wrong. He might be right. Uh, that's it for Outrageous Predictions. I'm Bill. That's Ari. Thanks for watching on Cleveland.com.